Welcome to the second episode of the Sport Relic Sportcast. I'm your host, Lazar, and today we're talking college football, and this weekend is littered with potential upsets as we have not really seen any incredibly dominant plays or games from any one top team. Dang it. One more take. Come on. Third time's a charm. All right. Okay. Welcome to the second episode of the Sport Relics Podcast. I'm your host, Lazar, and today we're talking college football in this third weekend that is littered with potential upsets as we have not really seen any incredible dominant games from any one team from the top 25. Georgia had a great game week one versus Oregon, who's now ranked 25, and Ohio State's comeback victory at home against the Fighting Irish isn't looking that great after Notre Dame lost to Marshall at home this past weekend. Let's run down the highlighted games of the week. So we got number one Georgia that is playing at South Carolina, the Gamecocks, who is coming off a 30 to 44 loss against Arkansas. That game is 12 p.m. Eastern time. We have number two Alabama playing at home in their parents game uh, this weekend against Monroe. This one should be a blowout and will actually be at the game 4 p.m. Eastern. Uh, the number third ranked team, OSU, is playing an in-state college with Toledo. You should expect the same results with this game, just like the Alabama one. This will be at 7 p.m. Eastern on Saturday. And number four, Michigan, plays against UConn at home. This will be a good one to watch, considering that Jim Harbaugh just announced that J.J. McCarthy is now the lone starting QB at Michigan as a QB battle has ended. This one will be at 12 p.m. Eastern. And finally, we have number 11 MSU that plays in the West Coast against Washington. Michigan State hasn't let one team score more than one touchdown in both their previous games. That's a 7.30 p.m. Eastern start. Let us know who you think will be the upsets of this week and enjoy another beautiful weekend of college football. If you could like us on Facebook and Instagram at Sport Relics, and if you'd want your own university college football, Get it at sportrelics.com.